Hi friends, hope you are doing great. Today we are going to see this demo how to upload object in cloud storage bucket using Terraform. First we are going to install Terraform on cloud shell. Next we are going to create private key via service account. Third we are going to create cloud storage bucket using Terraform. Then we are going to upload object in cloud storage bucket by using the Terraform. So this is the link I have given. You can click that link friends. So download terraform so here we need to uh, click this linux and we need to run this uh, three commands okay so i am going to activate the cloud shell so i am activating the cloud shell so no need to uh, directly we can use the cloud shell for uh, this terraform demo friends okay no need to install in your local okay so i am going to check the terraform version right now so terraform hyphen hyphen version so if you are seeing uh, terraform uh, it is out of date okay so like that only it is showing okay i have clicked the link so www dot the same link only uh, it is reflecting here also friends terraform io downloads so if you are clicking this link it is opening okay so this is the link i have uh, i am going to run these three commands only okay so i am copying this command first command so i am going to run this command curl then uh, next we need to run second command sudo apt add repository so i am going to paste this okay i am sorry i have uh, pasted wrongly so i am going to paste it i i need to copy again okay let me copy it this uh, sudo add sudo apt add repository command then we need to paste it here enter this command and next third command we need to run it sudo apt get update sudo apt get install terraform we are installing the terraform right now sudo apt update okay sudo apt get update sudo apt get install terraform so it is running right now it will be uh, installing the terraform so one one thing friends you have to remember this is uh, ephemeral i think so so if you are doing terraform tomorrow then again you need to install these commands I am talking about only cloud shell only okay so if you are using uh, if uh, if you are unable to install in your local system then you can directly use the terraform here itself so for example if you are working with some other uh, official laptop then it will be problem right so that's what you can do these things in cloud shell itself okay terraform iphone iphone version i'm seeing you can see we have installed successfully terraform you can see terraform we have successfully installed okay so now i am going to create own directory make dir terraform 2022 okay i am going to create own directory and uh, i am going to open the directory cd terraform 2022 okay so i am putting ls there is no file here now we are going to uh, second step we are going to create a private key via the service account so first step we have done it sorry uh, first step we have done it already next we are going to create a private key via the service account so how to do that so go to that uh, gcp console and go to the iam add an admin so click the iam and admin and we are here we are going to create the service account key okay so already i have told these things in my previous uh, video also so it is easy only so go to the service account just click the service account I have clicked the service account it is loading right now let's wait for it service account so we need to click the service accounts okay it came now we need to click create service account okay now i am going to give the name uh, the service account name terraform 2022 okay just copy and put in description also create and continue click create and continue okay just uh, let's wait for it it is uh, creating right now i mean not creating it is loading so next we need to select a role okay so i am giving basic owner role here then click continue so next we need to click done now it is loading let's give some time after that we need to click done it is updating policy okay so it is loading right now just we are going to click okay now we need to click done click done okay now we have created the service account we need to click this link we need to click this service account and 
go to the keys and it is loading the contents just wait for it we need to create a private keys okay just select this add key and create new key and json format just click create now we are creating the private key for the terraform 2022 so it is loading okay so we need to copy this uh, file name and open wherever you you can put this name you need to note it down this name and uh, next is you have to copy the content from here just copy this content okay so just copy this content and paste it in your uh, document in your personal document or wherever you can paste it okay so i am pasting it here itself then we have done the these steps also then we need to go to that uh, next step so what is the next step means we have to go to the cloud storage in cloud storage actually we we have not yet created any cloud storage there is no cloud storage bucket you can see friends there is no cloud storage bucket we have not yet created anything we are going to create the cloud storage bucket and upload the object by using the terraform only okay that is what uh, today demo so it is loading right now i would like to uh, uh, show that on there are uh, no uh, cloud storage bucket created so it is still loading okay so you can see in console there is no bucket created what right? there is no bucket created right okay fine now we are going to do uh, do this in uh, cloud shell okay now i am going to put some i am going to paste this uh, this file name json file and uh, enter and we need to copy this content and paste it here okay so we need to paste it here okay then escape colon wq exclamatory okay so we have successfully pasted here now we have only one file okay so next level next step what we need to do means we need to va sorry va provider first we will put to provider va provider dot tf okay so next step va provider dot tf we will create this file first i am going to update it here provider provider google provider google then open braces and enter and the space name sorry uh, here we need to give the project okay so project equal to so we need to copy the project id from my console so this is my project id you have to put your project id friends so i have pasted my project id then enter next we need to give region so region i am giving us uh, europe i am giving europe hyphen west to hyphen a europe hyphen west to hyphen a then next is credentials we have to give credentials equal to double quotes dollar symbol open braces file open bracket double quotes so we have to paste the file name from here okay so you have to paste your file name json file name and close the double double quotes bracket and close the braces that's it so we need to uh, and enter uh, here we need to close the braces and we need to save this okay escape and colon wq exclamatory for saving this file okay so we have done it and uh, next thing is we have to open va main.tf so here we need to update uh, a few uh, terraform file i mean content so resource i'm typing resource space double quotes google underscore google underscore storage underscore bucket double quotes okay now we can this is a resource type friends google storage bucket is a resource type and gcs it is the name gcs so whatever name you can specify it here instead of gcs okay now uh, name we have to give name i am giving us this is a bucket name 
uh, it should be unique okay it's a bucket uh, unique id so we have to give the unique name only so i am giving the name as terraform bucket 2022 okay then we have to give location so we need to give the location equal to double quotes i am giving the location as europe hyphen west 2 i am giving the location and next is we need to give the storage class storage underscore class so i am giving the storage classes standard S T A and yeah, standard i am giving okay so next we need to enter and we need to close the braces so we have successfully done it friends we have, we have successfully updated for creating the bucket only next what we need to do means so vi provided rtf okay we have done which and everything okay now i am going to uh, run the terraform commands so terraform init command okay so it is initializing the backend terraform has been successfully initialized now we are going to run this terraform plan command so you can see friends we have done the terraform plan command and uh, we can see the location project everything and next we need to apply this terraform apply by using this command we are going to apply so you can see here bucket project id it is showing and uh, storage classes also it's showing okay so there is no error right now so we can move for next step that is terraform apply after running this command okay we need to give yes here after running this command the bucket will be created friends in google cloud console so now we are creating the cloud storage bucket apply complete resources one okay now you can refresh this page bucket will be created in console yes got it terraform bucket 2022 yes we have successfully uh, created the bucket next thing okay this is the uh, this is the location type and gs util uh, util url cloud console url you can verify this in under the configuration okay now we have done it next step is we need to upload the object in the bucket by using the terraform that's what we are going to do okay so how to do that now i'm going to click open editor friends open in a new terminal open in a new terminal i'm going to copy uh, some image from my desktop to uh, this uh, here in editor so it is loading right now let's give us some time let's give some time okay now you can see our folder is terraform 2022 so th these are the uh, files which we have created now i am going to uh, move this image google image from my desktop to uh, in this editor so it is it came right now google image.png okay so like that you can do it friends it is easy only okay so next what we need to do means just go to that uh, terminal again just put ls now you can see google image it came here and uh, we need to move that image to the cloud storage by using the terraform okay so va main.tf again we need to update uh, something in here in terraform file and uh, next i am going to put resource i am going to put resource double quotes and uh, google underscore storage underscore bucket underscore object okay so like that we need to give and close the double quotes and uh, this is the type okay so this is the type resource type this is the resource name okay resource name as picture i am giving whatever name you can specify it friends so then uh, open the braces and here we need to specify the name of the image so whatever image name you can good you can give i am giving us a google image that's it whatever image you can i mean image name you can specify it then bucket we need to give the bucket name so bucket name is uh, google sorry bucket is equal to we need to do like this friends bucket is equal to google underscore storage underscore bucket and bucket dot gcs gcs it's a resource uh, name top we have given right that one dot name okay so like that we need to specify it friends then we have to give the source source it is our image name only so we need to copy paste the image name google 
image img dot png so the same like a format we need to give okay dot also we need to specify and then close the braces we need to escape and we need to save this file okay press escape and colon wq exclamatory enter okay so you can see friends our uh, image name is google img dot png so the same image name only we have to specify it so be uh, please careful on that okay so we have given correct name only okay so correct only under the source i'm saying okay so next we need to save this file i mean already we have saved it no problem now we need to run the terraform commands so now i am going to run the terraform plan command let's see the magic so uh, after applying the object will be uploaded in the bucket so terraform plan we have done it so you can see friends under the name it is showing google image so plan want to add under the name you can see google image so definitely it will be added source it is showing that image uh, google image dot bng so now i am going to apply this terraform then definitely the object will be uploaded in bucket so enter your value yes so now creating picture i mean you can see that message apply complete resources one okay now you can refresh this page definitely object will be uploaded in bucket by using the terraform let's wait for it yes we have done it successfully we have done this uh, demo friends you can see the image here you can click this link authenticated url you can see the google image so i have uh, done uh, the demo today you can see this okay next we are going to uh, destroy okay so terraform destroy so it will be deleted i mean our bucket will be deleted so we need to give yes now our bucket will be deleted right now by using the terraform uh, destroy command so just click uh, okay it's showing some error no need to worry just go back just click refresh definitely it will be gone the bucket has been gone okay so we have if you are clicking refresh also the specified bucket does not exist okay we have done the demo friends successfully we have done this demo so now now we need to uh, delete the service account also service account we have to delete it so go to that uh, iim and uh, go to the service account go to the iim and admin go to the iim and bit iim and admin and here we need to delete this terraform 2022 just click remove under the iim i am deleting uh, just click confirm and it has been deleted then go to the service accounts service accounts click service account and we need to delete the terraform 2022 uh, delete so we need to delete carefully friends don't delete the default one okay app engine that compute engine so it should we should not delete those we should delete our uh, service account only so thank you so much friends we have done the uh, demo today successfully Thank you so much. Have a great day. Bye-bye.